Hello everyone, welcome back. My name is Tisa and it's so great to have everyone here. I'm here, I'm looking into July the 25th and the 26th is 2023. So I'm about to begin the elements right now. I'm going to go ahead and see which element I'm going to start with. I have right here Gemini and Virgo, so I'll go ahead and start with the air signs right now, okay? And see what we have coming up for you for the next 24 to 48 hours or so. Now, the words of understanding on my channel, I find a secretive energy that is hidden and I bring it to light. The mystery is solved here, so please enter at your own discretion, okay? All right, let's see what we have here. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel, this is Air, Aquarius, Libra, and Gemini, all right? The page is full. See, some, some truth is here, okay? Um, Ava could be some truth right here that's written down. I feel like with the water right there, it's emotional. Ava could be some truth right here that is about water in some way. Something here could be about water in some way. Um... All right, let me see. This is for Bowie over here. This was the um, Seven of Pentacles, okay? There could be some type of something here about water and investment. I don't know if this is a house or what. Okay, but something here could be about water. Some people are here. Okay. Somebody could be emotional, though, too. Okay, what's the next one here, please? All right. The world of card right here. So I'm getting like you are realizing right here. Something about water, it, it could be in a property. Some people are here, you are realizing right here, you need to drink plenty of water. Could be the case. It even could be what kind of water are you drinking? So, like that could be significant right there. All right? But there is some truth right here about something in some way. All right, page of wands is flipped over here in reverse and reverse. And um, that feel like it's not good news, it's not a source right here. It's reverse, all right. I feel like you come out of anxiety about it though. Something here isn't good news to you in some way. I feel like you know with the world card, this is not good news. It's time for me to come out of anxiety about whatever this is here in some way. Okay, so either you're going to know right here about what kind of water to drink or there's some water issue in some property or something like that. Okay, what's the message? Air signs. Seven of swords right here. Yeah, I feel like whatever's hitting right here is coming to light. So get right here. So much right here, please. Air signs right here. Yeah, I feel like it is the sun. That's revealed. Something's revealed here now in uh, some way. Okay, it could be about a Leo right here. Five of Pentacles right here. Okay, the Eight of Pentacles right here. Okay. So if somebody didn't put work into this property right here, you know, it's, this is what I'm getting here. Okay, so when you put work into a property. Then it's going to do what you know what you want it to do. But if you just abandon it, it's not going to do what's supposed to do here. So, okay, so that's some kind of feeling. I'm like, that's the truth here. Okay, Knight of Swords. All right, Seven of Swords right here in the Page of Swords. There, there could be some truth right here that somebody wasn't telling the truth about right here. Maybe somebody was being mischievous. Maybe they was running away or they had um. You know, some hidden dishonor or whatever like that. Somebody could be spying on them. That could be the truth here too. You know, what's the next one here? Page of Swords right here, Seven of Swords. This is Air. Page of Swords right here and the Seven of Swords for Air signs. Please, Aquarius, Libra, and Gemini. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Yeah, Knight of Swords come right back out here again. Somebody knows they're not telling the truth about something here. Or they was running away from the truth or whatever. You know, they know that. Knight of Swords right here reverse. It's not telling the truth right here. Okay, they're not telling the truth. Somebody know they're not telling the truth. They're lying about something right here. That's pretty it. Okay, they're lying about something right here. I feel with these two. Okay, so they're lying about it. Okay, could be a Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo right here. Could be about money, something like that. Okay, you know, could be a husband, or whatever. But somebody's not telling the truth about something. I'm getting right here. Okay, and I just feel like somebody knows they're not. Okay, and so I feel like they're heartbroken over here. Just basically, they're heartbroken right here. They're not telling the truth about something right here. Okay, so, you know, yeah. They know they're not. They know they're not in some way. Okay? Yeah, in the future right here. Or it could even be a third party or whatever. It could be three people. Okay? Maybe we get like three to six people. Could be the case right here. But it's three plus three. 
So it could be six people, right? But I'm just getting like, somebody's not telling the truth right here, okay? They're not. Could definitely be a tourist Capricorn or Virgo that's not telling the truth about people, okay? People could be a boss at work or whoever, but somebody's not telling the truth about something here in some way, okay? So I feel like they're going to be heartbroken as we move forward because you know they're not telling the truth about something here, you know? It's that kind of feeling like. Anything else right here, please? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, okay? Yeah, they, they have one of masks right here, and you know that, I feel. I feel. Like somebody knows that somebody's being deceptive in some type of way, or wearing that mask, somebody knows they have on the mask. You know, it's just pretty. They know they're above them right now. You know. So that's heartbreaking to them. Because I feel like they're not going to get any money or something like that because, they, you know, they're not telling the truth about something right here. You know. If somebody's being deceptive in any kind of way, I'm getting like 20. All right, let's say, for instance, somebody said they're going to give you $200, and only thing they gave you was $20. I'm going to like, they're going to be a regret for lying about it right now. Okay, that's the energy right now. Because that's the energy of a check we have going on here. Is that they're going to regret that right here, I feel. Somebody knows they're not telling the truth about something right here in some way. You know, this even could be false advertising. If they're false advertising something right here, somebody knows that they're not doing something here in some way. Okay, so I kind of feel like that right now. <laughs> That's revealed, okay? That's what we reveal right now. And that's what somebody's going to learn. They're going to learn that right now. Okay? Because somebody, you know, they're not trying to truthful something right here. Could, that boy. could be a Leo or whoever, but they're not. So, okay. Queen of Swords right here. This is you, Aquarius, Leap, and Gemini. I feel like you're intelligent, okay? I'm feel like you're very intelligent, very witty. Okay? Like, let's not get you to the witty so you start speaking with a sharp tongue or something like that, okay? So it kind of feels so it's like, you know, let's not, you're not telling the truth. I know you're not. Let's just keep it like that. So my dad, mm. get a sense, right? Let me see. Ooh. Seven of Pentacles right here in the sun. Yeah. It could be about a relationship. They're going to get back karma. They're not telling the truth about it. They're going to get back karma in some way. You know that truth. That's what I'm getting right here. Could be a Libra right here. Could be um, a Leo, a Christ, or a Gemini, you know. But the justice reverse is that that's bad karma. That will get bad karma some type of way. Okay. You know. There's some type of way. This could be about a relationship right here. Right now. Or, you know, that's not, that's some feeling. It's pretty... We try to do with some type of investment in some way here. Yeah. Somebody knows there's another person here. Could be a third person because I got two threes over here. So it could be a third person over here. Maybe somebody knows there's a third person here. They know that. Could be the case. This even could be with these two. Somebody knows what somebody was planning to do in the future in some way. They know that too. I'm getting right here. Okay. The Queen of Swords has showed up right here right away. This is you being very clear direct very intelligent very much so very much so very much so okay you might even know something about money or you're the wife or they're the husband or whatever it could be if it could be somebody else's husband or wife whatever way it goes here but i just feel like you know if they wasn't trying to take a relationship this could, even could be you you're not trying to take a relationship to the next level anymore with somebody here it could be it so they're gonna be awakened today no. Or if they didn't want you before, they want you now or something like that. Somebody here does. Could be it. Anything else right here? Seven of Pentacles right here. And the Sun. Yeah. So this even could be somebody understands you're leaving in some way. So that could be that you're leaving a job because I got a Queen of Pentacles right here. Or you could be leaving a house. Because this card could be travel. Ace of Wands could be travel as well. So, you could be having a new beginning in some way. And you could definitely make a clear decision about it, I feel. That you are going to have this new beginning, that you are going to travel, something like that. Um, if somebody over here is lying and they still expect you to be in a relationship with whoever this other person is over here. They could be expecting you still to be friends with somebody or whatever. Okay? They're going to get bad karma for thinking you still be friends with them when you know they're not telling the truth about something. They're going to get bad karma for that right now. Yeah. Yeah. 
Something here could be about traveling in some way. So somebody knows about traveling, or they know about a third person. You know, they know about something like that. Maybe somebody even knows something here about money in some way. You know, they know about that one here. If somebody's trying to come back because of money, somebody's going to know something like that. All these facts right here is here. The King of Swords and the Queen of Swords, they both are right here. It's like, you know, whatever's going on here, you know about it. It's, it could be like you already went through something before. So whatever somebody's doing here now, it's like I already seen that before. Already know that or already did that could be the case. Here. So whatever they're trying to do, it's like I already seen that or know that. Yeah, I told you guys before, air sign. Something here is not going to be double jeopardy, okay? Like, once you go through something right here and had a karmic lesson about something in some way, then the universe is going to make sure that you know about something the second time around, okay? Or you're going to already know about it because you went through it before, okay? But I don't feel like you're going to have double jeopardy. You're going to go through something right here that you already went before. I feel like you're going to see that very clearly. That's what this is or whatever, you know, something like that. So, yeah, so get in here. So I just feel like some cycle is over in some way. I feel like you are going to get a new beginning here in some way. Yeah. Something about hard times. I feel like that cycle is complete. I feel. You know, you have a completion to a cycle of hard times or struggling here. That cycle's over in some way. But I just seen the tower and the king of swords. Like it's just it's just some truth that's about to show up right here now. That's that's gonna be undeniable. Cause I just feel like, you know, you already seen something like this before, or you already seen this before. Whatever it could be that we're talking about right here in this particular message right here. But you already seen something like it before. It's not gonna happen again. There's no way you can do double jeopardy. It just not. Okay. So the five of pentacles in the world, let's see. All right, what's the five of pentacles right here in the world card? Right? Yeah. It even could be something already completed in the past. Or maybe you already learned about something in the past or when you was a child. Could be the case. Could be the case here. Yeah. I already learned it when I was a child. Could be it. Yeah, look at the king of swords right here again. It's a lot of people here too. My goodness, look at that. King of Swords, King of Cups, right? The, the Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. Look at that. And the King of Pentacles right here. So that's three people right there, right? And then these two people just showed up right here. It can be more than one person that is really having bad karma right now for some, for some people here, air signs. It's more than one person that's going to feel you right now. This period, this sword is right here. They're going to feel you right now. Okay? Or something about karma, they're going to feel that right now. Yeah, I feel like it's double karma. Something like that. It's in my hands right here. Okay? They're going to really realize that. I feel like it's definitely more than one person right here now. It could be up to six or seven people right here. That's realizing right here, something they was doing before, they're regretting it right now, I feel. They're going to regret it right now. So I'm cheating in line. It wasn't telling the truth about something before. They're all regretting it right now. I'm getting right here. This could be definitely more than one person, I feel. Okay. This is people from the past, I feel. Yeah. This here could be some situation. You already went through that. They think they can come over here now and do it. They can't. You already, you already learned a lesson about that. You already can see something clearly when you see it. Okay. Let's say like this right here, right? So, all right. Once you learn that this is a crystal, it's power right. Then you see it again, you're gonna know it's power right. Somebody can't say that's not power right, you already know it is. Something like that. Okay. Something like that. Okay, somebody's power is something right here, too. Yeah, the tower right there and the king of swords. I, I told you guys that before. So, the tower right here and the king of swords is the truth. It's a revelation that you know the truth about something right here. There's some cycle already completed in the past in some way. Some cycle already completed in the past right here. Somebody is definitely powerless. I feel like it's definitely more than one person. I'm, I'm seeing right here, five to eight people. It could be, depending on who's watching the video. But yeah, I'm seeing like five to eight people at least. It could be right here. Just realizing right here, they're gonna regret something right now. 
I don't have money. No, no. That you have higher wisdom and knowledge. This could be a marriage, okay, or religion or something. You know the truth about religion. They get bad karma for something. Some way. You know. Could be the case. So for some people here, you know, I'm just getting like, they're going to come out of anxiety. That something's the truth. There's no getting like, something is the truth right here. Okay? That you're skilled. You could be very skilled right here. This card could also represent somebody being consistent and dedicated about something, but I just feel like it's not good news in some way because I feel like that you're skilled. So how is it going to be good news? They're trying to play these games over here. Somebody. Seven of Swords, cheating and lying. That's not good news. They're cheating and lying about something right here. Somebody knows they're lying. Somebody already can see something for what it is here over here. Okay, because you're skilled. And it's really not good news that they was lying about something right here somewhere. I feel like something's going to go into your favor. They realize that. And there's nothing they can do about it. Because whatever they did right here in the past... Or you see something right here from the past now. It's clear for you to see something about the past now. Like that, you know. But something's going to go into your favor, I feel. It's, it's about to go right here into your favor, I feel, right here. That's fate. It's destiny. Something's going to go into your favor somewhere. Okay? I feel like you're going to get a new beginning. Something here that's very stable, um, dependable, reliable. Could be some prosperity. Could be some abundance of money. That could be going to your favor right now for some people right here. I feel like somebody wants to apologize to you. Some people right here. All right. Yeah. Or somebody right here. All right. Um. I kind of feel they want to send you love messages with a page of cups. I just feel like whatever they did in the past, they shouldn't have done it. They shouldn't have, they, sh they, they just shouldn't have done it for it. Okay? Because I feel like something here is not your first rodeo, whatever they was doing. Okay? It's like, it's not. Okay? It's not. It's not. It's not your first rodeo. Okay. Somebody here now wants to negotiate something right here with you, you know, or something. <laughs> Like, I want you back or something. Somebody wants you back or something like that. They want a family or to work out something right here with money. Something like that. I feel like you're not into it, some people right here. Whatever they're trying to work out or apologize to you about or even to send you some um, love messages right here. It's like some facts is here. Okay? You know? The facts is it. Once you see something, you can't unsee it. You know what I mean? You can't. This is a phone. You know what I mean? Huh? So, what we're going to do, that's a phone. So nobody can make it be something else. It's not. It's a phone. Okay? So, yeah, I feel like somebody's awakened to something like that. This could be somebody's twin flame. Could be the Okay. What's this kind of cups right here, please? And a nine of swords reverse right here. They won't be a family with you. Somebody for some people they won't be a family with you. For some people they want to um you know, maybe have a house with you. This could be a landlord or whoever else it could be, or a tenant or whatever, but you know, it's kinda of like a struggle over here to do it in some way. To come out of anxiety about something here about a family or um anything else, okay. They want, they even want to reconcile right here with you. Or they want to come out of anxiety right here about a third party. Or whatever happened when you reunited with them. You know, something like that. That's what they want to do right here. Some illusion is not going to go anywhere. 
somebody's having fear that something here is not going to go anywhere in some way and i feel like it's definitely not in this situation right here all right because i just feel like it's bad karma over here it's bad karma you've been awakened to something already i hope something here somewhere four cups right here um, so it's a missed opportunity all right so yeah let me get a couple of these and then we'll end it up right here okay so this is air for you sleep with gemini next 24 and 48 hours right here blue right here trust peace loyalty right here cleanliness reliable confidence and healing right here. so blue that's a nice color I feel like you're very confident about something right here in some way. Yeah. Guardian angel, blessings of love all around you right here. Alright. Silver is also here. It says glamour, psychic abilities, modern technology, grace, the word of God, reconciliation, healing, intuition, wealth, and dreams right here. So blue and silver, that's the colors that's showing up on your feet. I see healing here twice. I feel like you're healing in some way. All right. Beauty secrets. Okay. And then we have real estate contract. Real estate contract right there. All right. Beauty secrets right here. And beauty school. So that could be significant to you in some type of way. But both of these cards right here definitely say healing. It says healing right here. Right. And then we have the word healing again. It's right here on my finger. So, somebody here did want to heal something right here with you. It could definitely be something about um, a beauty school or some secret. It could be right here, real estate. Maybe something here about a real estate in some way. They want to heal something like that with you in some way. Yeah. Because I feel like you're manifesting miracles at a rapid rate now. Yeah. Something here, nothing's going to stop you now. Yeah. Something here is not going to stop you now. Okay. Okay. Right here. Major redesigning to a website right here. And this one right here says facts. No man is too busy for someone that he truly wants. And that's the facts. <laughs> that's the facts right now, okay? All right. Any other message? Let's get two more. We'll end it right here, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels is air. I pray you sleep in Gemini. The next 24 hours right here. All right. So we have right here. Hidden for now. Still a mystery. All right. How can I live without you? Somebody didn't realize to now, I feel. How are they going to live without you in some way? <laughs> well, they didn't realize to now that you're going to manifest big miracles right here at a rapid rate about something right here. This says saxophone, music, band, singing. Maybe you're in a band could be the case for some people here. Or music or anything like that. But look at that. It says 888. Oh, yes. And that is definitely a number of incoming power and wealth for some people here. So that could be happening for somebody right here. Okay. But anyway, that's what I have. Thank you so much for taking a look now. I'm saying you all peace, blessings, love, and light, and we'll get back together again soon. Namaste to you.